everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're exploring some exciting developments from the Linux Mint team. In particular, we'll focus on the upcoming release of LMDE 7, the Linux Mint Debian edition that's set to bring OEM installation support along with several notable improvements. Overview of LMDE 7. LMDE 7 will be based on Debian GNU Linux 13 Trixie, which is scheduled for release in June 2025. Traditionally, Linux Mint has offered two versions, the main edition based on Ubuntu and LMDE, which uses Debian as its package base. With LMDE 7, Linux Mint is taking a significant step forward by introducing full OEM support. This new capability means that LMDE 7 can be pre-installed on computers destined for sale or donation, easing the setup process for the end user. Why OEM install support matters. OEM, or Original Equipment Manufacturer, installations are critical for hardware vendors and enthusiasts alike. When a computer is shipped directly from the manufacturer, it comes without personal user configuration details such as usernames, passwords, or locale settings. Instead, a first-run wizard prompts the end user to complete the setup when they power on the device for the first time. With OEM support finally arriving in LMDE 7, businesses and individual donors can now pre-install Linux Mint on their machines, much like they do with other mainstream operating systems, such as Windows or Mac OS. Other enhancements in LMDE 7. But that's not all. The Linux Mint team is also working on several other improvements. Enhanced file search. The Nemo file manager is getting a powerful upgrade. A new filtering feature that leverages regular expressions will allow users to search for files by matching parts of file names more flexibly. This update is expected to benefit everyone from novice users to power users who rely on precise file searches. Improved Wayland compatibility. Cinnamon's Wayland session is set to receive better support for keyboard layouts and input methods. Although the Wayland session remains experimental at this point, these improvements highlight Linux Mint's commitment to future-proofing its desktop environment. Refined JavaScript engine versioning, the Cinnamon desktop relies on the CJS JavaScript engine. Up until now, CJS shared its version number with Cinnamon. In the future, however, CJS will be versioned based on the underlying Mozilla engine and updated independently. This change will simplify packaging for distributions like Debian and Ubuntu, reducing the maintenance overhead for many users. Implications for Linux Mint and the community. These updates suggest that LMDE is not just a contingency version, but could very well be groomed to become a more central part of the Linux Mint experience. The addition of OEM support in particular indicates that Linux Mint wants to broaden its footprint by offering a more out-of-the-box solution for both enterprise and individual users. Conclusion in summary, LMDE 7 promises several enhancements that are poised to improve both the user experience and the flexibility of Linux Mint installations. Whether you're a business looking for a robust, ready-to-go Linux solution or a Linux enthusiast excited by cutting-edge updates, LMDE 7 is definitely a release to watch in the coming months. That's all for today's update. If you found this video informative, please leave a like Share your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe for more Linux news and tutorials.